Hello, this is Richard, this is Games Freezer, and today we are doing another 10 minute taster. Hurrah! We're on the PC, we're playing Glyph, and again, it's a game that I've never played before, and I'm going to give you my first impressions of as I play it for the first time. So let's get stuck into a new game. Um, I know it's a platformer um, of the ilk of our. Uh, I don't know, maybe a marble madness from days gone by where you're controlling a ball, but in a 3D environment and um, you're kind of looking to try and negotiate the obstacles in a kind of 3D open world, um, collecting items as you go along. Um, and that's about as much as I know, so let's get cracking. It's received a lot of good reviews on previous platforms, so. Um, this is the PC version that I'm playing that just recently came out so uh, so far so good looking uh, pretty plush but that's me I'm assuming I'm like a ball rolling rise and shine glyph my name is Anobi I'm the one who woke you up now that you're awake we must find the lost temple of Aru Try rolling around a bit and get used to your new body. Use uh, left analog stick and B to continue. Right, okay. So I can change the camera with my right analog stick. Feels very smart. I've got this kind of like nice slide to it as I get into a uh, change of direction, which is very nice. Okay, camera rotation, I'm certain this is the way. Try looking around glyph, use R. Yep, very nice. Level of control is uh, pretty lovely. Portal keys, collect all portal keys to open the warp portal. One. And I'm in. Beautiful. Right. Game looks lovely, by the way. It really does look nice. It's obviously simple presentation, but it's done really, really well. Right. Okay. So, what else we got over here? Deadly services. Watch out for the sand and deadly services. Obviously around here we've got that kind of lava stuff. Coins are used for unlocking hub portals leading to new sites. Collect all coins on this bridge here and I will fix the missing part. I'll see. Use your camera. Lovely stuff. Momentum. Use your momentum to gain speed. Master your momentum you'll be able to go anywhere. that nice little break before I got to there okay view progress you can view progress in any area anytime this will also help you if you missed anything press Y to use oh I see oh, in fact it's not out of normal right okay yeah up the hill up the hill up the hill don't go off the edge now change my camera size so I can look the right way give it a little break before the end up here nice tight controls that's what you want that's what you're getting with this game tight controls beautiful right okay B to continue let's have a look kind of got these ramps and stuff looking good right let's go ready for a challenge this area will test your balance I will keep you company as you go The level of control you've got, I can't overstate if I'm honest, it's really nice. You can do mid-air control as well. Oh! Look at that! <laughs> I managed to keep, keep myself on. Nice um, soundtrack as well to this. How am I going to get up there? I need a bit of an oomph. Go on momentum, go on momentum, go on momentum. Yes. 
if you keep your rolling up and don't stop, you get that extra momentum, which is all good. Fantastic. Yeah, I think you're ready to learn some new tricks. I can't wait to show you. See you on the other side. All right. Okay, I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Right, what have we got here then? Okay. Right. Nice, nice. We go again. What's this? Jump! Yay! You can now become charged by touching safe services. Use the charge to jump. Use A to jump. Right. Nice. That is a nice jump. Ugh. That weren't so good. So maybe I need to kind of uh, string it together. Oh yeah, that was nice. Look at that. Oh, am I going to get that? Can I do it? Can I do it? Put your back into it. Yeah, there we go. see myself stringing together oh you swatikus I wonder where it leaves me oh it puts me to the start look yeah oh there must be a um, some kind of checkpoint system maybe who knows we'll see at least I don't have to collect everything again though I can just zip through Ooh, smoking. Right, there we go. Hmm. Oh, I've got like a double jump. Double jump, nice. We're good, we're good, we're good. Right, through the portal we go. Got a double jump. Ooh, this looks tricky. Now I've really got around my corn by the looks of it. What are you saying, mate? What are you saying? Fragile platforms. Fragile platforms will disappear when hit and reappear after a while. Okay. So, I'll nail this, I suppose. Got this nice... Nice control over your jumps. Ooh, he says as he nearly falls off. Look at that. Like it. Right, okay, we're nearly there now. Yes, that was good. That double jump is what it's all about. Double jump and the control with the uh, left analog stick. That's the key, I think. Right. Okay, looks like I'm going to get another ability here. That's what that looks like over there. I have to... Oh. Double jump. I thought I already had one. You can now perform... Become energized by touching energizing surfaces. Use it to perform double jumps. Use A. Oh, is that? Oh, right. That's an energized surface. Right. Oh, that's a proper double jump. Kind of gives you a little boost. Now I've got that, I go This is cool. I need to get over there.
Oh, the concentration. Um, did it. What are we saying? Corrupted sands. Life used to flourish here, Glyph. Many years ago, something went terribly wrong. It began, it began the great cataclysm which devastated the ancient civilizations. The corruption still seeps deep within the sands. Whatever you do, Glyph, stay out of the sand, boy. Kind of like got a second jump if you touch a surface, which is cool. So rather than it being a double jump, I'll refer to it from now onwards as the second jump, which gives you a little bit more control over what you're doing, which is nice. Right, what's happening next? Hello. Energy rings. Those energy rings will recharge your energy in midair. Use that to jump to extra times. Ooh. did it <laughs> I thought I was gonna come off the edge there nicely done nicely done this game makes you look like a platforming genius basically because the amount of controller that it affords you enables you to be able to pull off some things you wouldn't normally think you'd be able to do in a platform game which is um, very very cool idea Oh my god. See that? I've got like the back spin. What are we saying here, mate? Anything? No ability unlocked. Glide. You can now glide for a short amount of time while in the air. You can hold the glide to go further, higher and further. Use LT. Okay. See where have I got to get to over there? Oh, this is nice. Again, implemented a simple mechanic, but implemented it really well, in my opinion. Right, okay. Oh. What am I coming next? Oh gosh, here we go. That's so how I'm going to get the key. Wall climbing. You can climb walls by continuously jumping up against them. Ah, that's where I was talking about the second jump. Okay, so I'm going to need to do that here, aren't I? Because I was a bit worried about how the hell I was going to get up. But that's lovely. That is nice. Right, okay, here we go again. Here we go, here we go, here we, here we, here we go. Yeah, and I don't even need to land to um, initiate the wall climb. Nice. Very cool, very cool. Got wall climbs, I've got glides. I have got double jumps. I am a happy boy. Right, what's going on here then? What else are you giving me? Smash! Use X. You can now smash directly downwards when in the air. This use this to jump higher and interact with certain objects. Okay. Like you can use it infinitely as well. Um right, what do I want to do? Oh. Oh, jump higher, yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that, kind of like bounce you up and then you can glide, right? I think that's what it's wanting me to do. 
take me a little while to get used to, I think. But uh, yeah, it kind of. You just want to bounce up. Well, this is like a. That's nice. Gain the height. Oh, balls. So gain the height. No. Gain gain the height. Do that and then crash again. What? Well I've got an achievement there. Keep trying. Jump and interact with certain objects. Don't know if I'm doing this right. Let's have a look at that little um Yeah, oh that is right. I'm, what I'm doing is right. I'm just not timing it properly and I'm pressing the wrong buttons a lot as well. Okay, jump, bang, and then crash again. <laughs> but I've got to do it all in one motion rather than just... I need the momentum, basically, is what it's saying. Okay. I'm not going to make that, am I? Twat. Right, get some momentum. Jump. I did it first time, didn't I? Get your momentum. I'm not going to do it again. Jollocks. I think I'm overthinking it. And I should be doing it at the end rather than just before. Just roll, jump. Something like that, eh? Oh, you douchebag. Oh, that was close. Nah. I thought I might be able to bounce on the sand. That feels like it, doesn't it? That must be it. It's kind of like you get to the edge, you jump. No, the momentum carried me forward. Get to the edge. Maybe if I just stand on the edge, look. If I got here, rather than trying to do it as part of momentum, if I just did. No, that's not it either. It's timing, which I'm not very good at. Right, okay. Use that rit Oh yes, did it. <laughs> Use that re reticule. Reticule, that's the right word, isn't it? So that little round thing that I need to use. What's this? Um... Oh yeah, that gets me very... So if I go forward off of that green thing... And then employ the glide. Oh, cracker tower. Oh, no, it's all the way back to the start, isn't it? Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> right, okay, come on. Oh, you little. I'm really showing my limitations now after saying. Yeah, yeah, this gives you so much control. My limitations are the problem. Oh, God. Well done. Oh, I can give myself a little boost, can't I? At the end of it, so maybe that's what I need to do here, anyway. Right. Right, what we need to do here is... Come on. Did it! Look at that! Whew, that was hard work, but I did it. Oh, speeders. Ready for some speed? A speeder will send you flying. Make sure to smash before hitting the cliff over there. Oh, I see. So speed towards the cliff, then press X to smash, right? Okay. Oh, too early. Gotta use the. Uh... Oh, nice. Send me back to the start. 
Oh man. Tutorial is now owning me. Oh look, I can do that, Connor. Yeah, must remember I can still do that midair. See that? You can just do a little extra jump at the end. See that? That's all good. Uh, oh, up the wall. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. I'm getting the hang of it again now. Right, okay. Power gems. Glyph, I found a power gem. Go ahead and take it. You will need power gems to unlock and restore areas of the temple city of Aru. Aru, there's nothing you can't do. Right, use me double jump as well, remember. Forgot about that. Silly Billy. Lost relics in the final days. Countless re relics were hidden in the shattered remains of our once great domain. Sacred coins, power gems, and ancient artifacts must be returned to the temple city of Aru. There's nothing you can't do. You must return the lost relics. Glyph, I will guide you as far as I can. We will be at the temple soon. Cheers, mate. Whoever you are. Oh, this is double jump time, right? We're in. Right, okay. I'm back on board. I'm good. I'm good. I think I know. Down jump. Gliding, all sorts. Stringing all those uh, things together. That's the key. Right. Got more to tell me, mate. Reach higher. To reach higher, first smash. Then, as soon as you touch the ground, do a double jump. Oh my god, and immediately after glide. Oh no. Smash, double jump, and glide. Oh, okay. I think I'm with you. Smash, double jump, then glide. Oh shit. Yeah, no. No, double jump, you twat. Oh, you crocotoa. How can I double jump if I'm not charged? I know that bit. Oh, uh, this could be my downfall. To reach higher first smash, then as soon as you touch the ground, do a double jump. Smash X A A L T. Stop interrupting me. Yes! That was hard. <laughs> I've got that then. Oh, this, this is tough. I've got to admit. Oh no, this is going to be hard. Bollocks. Cock that right up. Oh, nice. Take me to the start as well. Right. Oh, don't interrupt me. Every time. Oh, that was close. That's quite annoying, that little interruption there. Because I know what I'm meant to be doing. Now it won't let me do it. Ah. 
That's it. No, oh, I cocked that up. I didn't do the bounce. Oh, that was even better. Is that like a... It's like a... Yeah. I don't know what that was, but anyway. Well done. Right, this is it. This is it. This is it. This time I know it's the. Oh, I need to recollect that key again. How can I. How can I do it? Oh, back to the start. Right, this is my last run. He says. Ah, oh, right. This is my last run. Just want to get back to that key bit. Right, did that. Learnt that. Got there. Um. Got there. That was pretty easy. So, what am I doing wrong here? I think what I need to do is go at it. Oh, you twat. I thought I was going to get the charge at that point. Right, this is my last go. Right, come on. Oh, you dickhead. This is my last go. Jump, bosh, bosh, bash, bish, bosh. Oh, you! What am I doing? I'm trying to rush it. That's why. If I went and got the charge from here, so then I want to bounce up, glide, then double jump. Let's try that. This is my. This is my. Yes! Whoo! Uh, the corruption. The builders once created a powerful machine to protect themselves and bring safety to the civilization. Something went terribly wrong and the machine came became corrupted. The machine corrupted everything in its path. What should have been the greatest achievement became their downfall. Right, what have we got here then? Am I going to be able to do this? Oh god. Right, so how do I want to play this one? It's a jump, bounce, double jump glide yeah jump bounced glide let's get this coin right that my friend is that I'm a skilled scarab and I'm ready to rumble this is a cracking game I've really enjoyed doing this 10 minute taster and it's going to be a game that I will carry on playing beyond this 10 minute taster let's have a little look at what happens next feels like I've just gone through the um, through the tutorial so let's see if we can finish this off if not then I'll call it a day gem locks use gems to unlock areas of the temple approach a lock to see the gem cost oh, okay you have one gems 51 coins uh, press B to unlock right yeah so I can open up new areas with gems and they pop out the sand that's pretty neato 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 so where do I go from here like this T 
temple entrance. What, what are you saying? The heart of creation. Glyph, you have been awoken to cleanse the corrupt heart of creation. The temple city of Aru, Aru is buried here in the sands. You must travel to the ruins of the ancient civilizations and collect the lost power gems. Only then you will be able to restore the temple city of Aru and face the source of corruption. Cheers. Uh, temple entrance. Use coins to unlock portals. Special time portals require artifacts. These can be obtained after collecting all coins in an area. Right, so... Where do you want me to go? I want to go over this way? Oh, I see. Two to unlock that one. Temple entrance. I'm still a bit baffled about where I'm going next, if I'm honest. Two to unlock that. What have I got to do? Is it this way? Ah, right. There we go. So those are the entrances, those little areas there. So let's try one of these and we'll call it a day. Five time-worn tablets. Uh, exploration sunlit dunes. Right, let's do that one. Ooh la la. All right, so they pop out by out those balls. Right, okay, and then I'm in. Right, so that's how we're breaking it down into kind of levels, difficulty areas. Right, let's see if I can do this one, and then we will definitely call it a day, even though I don't really want to, but um, it's probably about the right time for a 10 minute taster to run. Uh, run about the half hour mark, give you a good indication of what the game is like. Let's uh, crack on. Sunlit dunes, eh? Oh, well, it. Ah! You twat. So, what I need to do is I need to maintain that charge because I don't think I need the double jump on the. Uh, next part because I want to get that gem right ah I cocked it oh, I can just go down there and get it can I hi Glyph I did not expect to see you here already I have something to tell you I sent something odd in the air behind the portal can you check it out think the area hides something hopefully you can find out what ooh la la right okay hi glyph yep yeah, yep yeah. did that bit already how am I meant to get to that oh okay so got it nice I think it could probably be a bit oh look what's that Is that in the air? Yeah, it is. Alright, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to go jump, bang. Got it! Right, then we are going to. Now we're going to get out of here. Jump. Right, okay. So he was saying about the area behind the uh, portal. Let's see if I can get some height. Oh look, yeah, like that. Wowzers, what's going on here? Think, 
I was meant to sort of follow that through, but I didn't. Uh, it's up there, whatever that secret is. Kind of need to follow the um, the shoot thing. you little monkey right okay that's me done I reckon I'm gonna call a halt to it there but this has been lots of fun hopefully you've enjoyed it too and um, if you have liked the video please press the like button because um, that helps us also subscribe to the channel because that helps us get more games into the games freezer to take a look at um, we're over on Twitter we're at games freezer um, we're also on Instagram at Games Freezer. We're over on www.gamesfreezer.co.uk. Crunch. Um, and my friends, we're over there we have loads of uh, articles on retro gaming, indie gaming, um, new and old games. It's all good. Um, we also do a lot of when I say we, Brit does a lot of um, oof, recent uh, vinyl reviews for video game soundtracks, which is uh, proving to be a big hit. Um, so yeah, plenty to check out. But my friends, until next time, goodbye from me at the Games Freezer as I get stuck into Glyph. Goodbye, my friends. <laughs>